don't care if she's friends with Madison. She can identify with Madison in a totally different way than yeah. my association with her. Well, she came to my house um, to talk to me about the situation, and she presented to me, you know, that she felt bad, she shouldn't have done it, and seemed like she had genuinely, like, felt some type of remorse. I feel bad. Have you talked to Danny at all? I had reached out to her, and no response. So I was hoping that maybe you could help me. Figure out how to navigate yeah. that. Yeah. Like, I'll do whatever it takes to, like, try to make it OK. But sometimes when I'm so upset, like, and I'm mad, I don't know how to control my emotions. Like, I'm about to freak out. Whether it was genuine or not, she, that's how she presented it to me. And I went back to a few years, you know, prior, where I was kind of crazy and, like, said some shit like out of nowhere. You came to our house, I was nine oh months God. pregnant, went to the mother strip club, you nasty mother There's some things you can't come back from. Right. And the other person and you can't come back like, from. And I told her like 100% I did not agree with what she did. The whole problem with facts crap, you truly don't know what you're talking about. And you are hurting people that shouldn't be hurt. Why don't you I'm go? I'm your team, so why the f are you acting like this? Go chain smoke your menthols and get the I out of my. I've been cigarettes since I've been here. Shh, don't care. What are you even here? Good question. She's a psychopath. She should approach you and apologize. And I feel like I Which tried she, to like. She did, but and I just couldn't look at her. I was like, yeah. this means nothing to me. Like right. it, what's done is done. Like right. you've showed yourself. Like I, note taken. Like. Deuce. All right, I just tried to give her like at least a chance to try to be genuine and say sorry if she really genuinely well, felt that way. Well, she's a mom. Way. Like you, I mean. I don't know. I just I felt like I hit it off with you so well. Yeah, me you too. know, and I want to get the kids together and like I think we have a lot in common. It's not like Austin and my son and I all hang out. I mean that's like a huge step for me. Oh uh, yeah. And I don't want my son to be like heartbroken because he's gonna like any guy there. Yeah. We're all still getting to know her, really. I know enough. <laughs> well, the way that she was with y'all scares me because I feel like people that just throw shit out in the air and see what sticks is dangerous. Like, those people are dangerous to be around. But at the same time, I do have, like, a weird soft spot for her in the sense of I did some crazy shit in the past and I was given a chance. I mean, it took a few years to reach a level of, like, I don't know, forgiveness with these people, you know what I mean? Men around here are always so quick to jump on the girl. Like, you say one thing wrong, do anything that gets misconstrued. It's the girl's nuts. The girl is the one that's crazy. Yeah. I think us girls should stick together. Because that's going to be the only thing that makes the men change is if no girl accepts the, right. the bullshit. Yes. Never will, never have. Nope. Well, have, well. never will again. <laughs> But you didn't do anything vindictive to anybody else. Right. So it I is mean, different. You didn't like go out of your way to yeah. persecute somebody. Right. People were just in your business. That's totally different. Yeah. I mean it's a hard it's a hard thing place to be in for me. Whatever makes her happy, I'm fine with. I just don't want to be around her. Danny's my best friend still always. <laughs> doesn't affect our relationship. Yeah. I think Austin was the one that brought it up to me that he felt odd about Madison being invited because they weren't dating. And he was like, oh, she's not friends with anyone. Why is she coming? But then immediately, they're like going back and forth like nothing was awkward or wrong. You want to do kissy, kissy stuff? Yeah. Oh my God. Thank you, Craig. So y'all hooked up last night? No. No. Bullshit. Serious. I went to bed, man. Oh, boy. She woke up naked, too. Yeah. Whoa. You're a strong man. Yeah. Sorry I ever doubted you. <laughs> I didn't wake up naked. I just didn't have a shirt on. That's a hint from mm. your mother. What did she say? Always sleep Always in the sleep in the nude. Mm -hmm. Keep it spicy. It is the most unhealthy, exhausting relationship I have ever witnessed. Austin is a, t is a very nice, attractive guy. I mean, she's attractive too. So go your uh, go your separate yeah, ways. Yeah, like they just shouldn't be you in a relationship options. together. It's like you don't know if they're together or not, and I. And then they immediately. I just acted assumed like they, they weren't were. together in the beginning because she was like flirting with people on the internet. You having fun this weekend? Yeah, are you? Yeah, I am. I think it's been great. I think it's been great. But like, is that real life? You know, I mean, it's like one thing to act a certain way around your friends, and you're like... Well, apparently, to them, we fight all the time. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. 
It's funny because there there was like a little moment and Catherine was like, Austin, is this is this like you know tough for you? You guys ready to go to bed? Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. This is like a dollar bill, you know, being dangled in my face. Like, I mean, we're in the same house. Like, we're on, you know, vacation. When you're on vacation, you, like, the last thing that I wanted to do was bring up the things that make us fight. It's very clear that I have so many feelings for you. And I don't want to see you with anyone else but me. But I'm not going to be, like, sitting at home making dinner and then you think you're going to show up at... 11 o'clock. It's about compromise, and you're not willing to do that. And that's why we're not together. So what, like, are, are you with Charleston and date other people? Like, is that what you want to do? It's not what I want to do. He was seeing her the whole time. Yeah. We, I mean... He just hit it he from He lied us. to all of us. They, I mean, I, I didn't ever talk to her. They had been dating. I mean, this is not anything new. Yeah, he tried I'm, to hide I mean, it from us again, so he wouldn't he's get not shit. as good of an actor as she is. You could totally tell... I mean, they were trying to pretend like they hadn't been seeing each other for the past month, and they had. Hey, y'all, it's Austin. Subscribe here if you like the video, and click here for more content.